What's up, weebs? Another week of Daima is in the books, and today this episode was, you know, a little less than uh, last episode with lore-wise, but it was also still action-packed. We got our first look at Super Saiyan Goku, we got the king of the third demon realm, and we are now on our way to the next uh, station, next station, next area that we're going to go to for, for uh, a couple episodes. The episode mostly started with, a, like, the entirety of the first half of, uh, you know, getting introduced to Pansy, her kind of uh, making her way into the group, becoming part of the part of the trio that is now the the, the four the four stack, <laughs> and they're heading their way to Kadan Castle, I believe it was called, to meet up with the uh, the king to deliver Goku, who Glorio said he would deliver someone who is stronger than Majin Buu, so they can take out King Goma, and. Turns out Pansy is actually the princess of the castle, which is kind of a funny thing because later on when they talk about the plan to get rid of King Goma and also save Dende, the king offers Pansy's hand in marriage and Goku, uh, you know, while they thought he was a child, lets them know that he's already married with kids. And the little funny thing I think in there was that he could have told, he could have told him that he's also married to a princess because Chi Chi is the Ox King's daughter, which makes her the princess. So that's, that's a little thing he could have thrown in there for, uh, Kind of the credibility thing but after that whole conversation uh the king wanted uh, a little demonstration of power and so goku said all right yeah it'd be good training and just like everybody else in the in the show except for supreme kai my guy uh they decided to give him the benefit of the doubt and think okay maybe he's just a little cocky but he wipes the floor <laughs> he wipes the floor with the however many soldiers they they brought around and he got a little super saiyan in there they they started to try to hold him down to maybe beat him but he went he did a little super saiyan uh explosion got everybody off and showed off the little daima goku super saiyan for just just a little bit and got a cool little pose in there supreme kai kind of you know a little little showing off there thinking hey this is why this is what i brought this is mine this is my work this is my work here and uh not that's about it it wasn't too much they um also explained that there are two goals in this is to either go to the first demon realm uh beat king goma and save dende and also um their second option is to get the demon realm dragon balls and wish to be an adult uh wish all the characters to be adults again so they can beat king goma even easier but uh we also switched over to goma's perspective where they are kind of just holding on to Dende. I guess they're going to try to raise him so they can make new Dragon Balls with him because the first thought I had when they turned Dende, Dende into a child is that he was kind of just pretending so they wouldn't, you know, off him in the immediately or just, you know, get rid of him at point blank. Uh, but now that I'm thinking about it, if they made everybody first grade um, age, which I guess is like, what, six or seven, uh, that's... That's like nothing. That's like just born in Namekian years because Namekians live a long time. Like Piccolo was eight when Dragon Ball Z started, so it's it's kind of young for these guys. Um, but after that, after all that, they get a new plane. They immediately crash it, by the way, because <laughs> they put too much uh, supplies and luggage inside the plane, so they they overweight it. And they just they just crash landed and now they're gonna probably go back to just walking again but now they have a plan they're going to uh, go they're going to get the first of the three Dymo realm Dragon Balls and now they have um, another courier or messenger for the king to go get Vegeta and the rest of the squad they're gonna meet up together and then we're gonna continue through um, the demon realm Pansy also did mention a little thing that the third demon realm is the uh, largest of the three, so this is probably going to be where we spend most of our time. And then we're going to probably stroll through Demon Realm 2, and then the big finale is going to be in the first Demon Realm. But we're very excited. It's it's not as much in this episode, but there was still some fun stuff. Uh, you know, more just regular Dragon Ball moments, journeying, really all of that. So hopefully the next episode will have a little bit more lore or even more action. I will take either one, but I'm really enjoying Diamond so far. I hope you guys are as well. Let me know what you guys are thinking about Diamond in the comments below, and I will catch you all in the next one.